Harry Demopoulos, Wikipedia Audio Harry B. Demopoulos is a researcher in the medical aspects of free radicals, especially in the areas of ischemic injury, the toxicity of anti-cancer drugs, and in spinal cord injury. He has also been a film actor and is currently a member of the Board of Trustees of the Doris Duke Charitable Foundation. Ischemic injury is an important cause of morbidity and mortality in humans. For example, most deaths in stroke and heart attack are secondary to ischemic injury, a consequence of the ischemic cascade. Thus, much research has been done into the causes and treatment of ischemic injury. One R of this research involves the essential role of free radicals as modulators of ischemic injury. This has resulted in therapeutic advances, such as the radical scavenging neuroprotective agent NXY059, which was under development for the treatment of stroke. Demopoulos and his co-workers were active in this research. The opening sentence of a paper by Nita Etal states, the concept of generation of free radicals during ischemia was first presented by Demopoulos, Flam, and co-workers. Free Radical Research Harry Demopoulos is a trustee of the Doris Duke Charitable Foundation, founded upon the death of the billionaire tobacco heiress. When Duke died in 1993 at the age of 80, Legal documents revealed she had previously assigned Demopoulos a longtime friend CO executor of her estate. However, a controversial change to her will near her death put her vast fortune in the control of her Irish born butler, Bernard Lafferty, whom Demopoulos described in a subsequent lawsuit as an illiterate, unstable, and even dangerous person. The litigants produced an affidavit from Tammy Payette. 28, a nurse who had attended to Duke in her final weeks. Payette maintained that Kivowitz and Lafferty had conspired to murder Duke through the use of massive sedation, including morphine, and Demerol. This lawsuit resulted in Lafferty being discharged. Partial Filmography Doris Duke Estate